Um, I definitely want to be an All-American. I've been working really hard for that for the last four years, basically. Um, my freshman year, I didn't really think I was going to go, and now that I'm there, I definitely think that I can do it. Definitely All-American. <laughs> Top eight. So, yeah. I like to get back to the, in the 180s, and if that gets me into finals, that'd be awesome. Uh, but I'd really like to get in the 180s again. Um, experience, I always tell them, is probably your best friend when you're throwing because, like I've always said, half of it's a mind game. Like, if you can't get past your mind barriers, you're going to have a really rough time. That's what I learned the first year I was there, that you can't get in, out, in there and freak out. It's just another day of throwing, and you have to perform your best at that sp very specific time. So you just have to go in there knowing that you can throw and just do it. In Montana, we don't right, go off of runway very much when we throw javelin. It's mostly off of grass. And so there is like a transition to running on a runway. Um, you go faster, you have to move back farther. So we'll be doing a lot of that when we're down there. Right now we just run on a little strip of track back here. So we get some practice, but it'll be different. So we'll have to do lots of practice on that so we're comfortable on the day of the throw. It's definitely something I've wanted for a long time, like coming into college, um, sports and track, of course, but um, just something I've wanted. I want to work for it like really hard. So. I'll be really like excited. I know there's a lot of people in the town like behind me and they're really rooting for me. Like at work this morning, everyone was like, let's go, like you got this, good luck. And that's really just a cool feeling and that makes me want to place even higher, so.